Hey there, everybody. Welcome to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Um, I played a few Metal Gear games, specifically Sons of Liberty, Snake Eater, um, there's one more I played. I don't remember which one it was, but anyways, um, I always see the the memes about this one, <laughs> the whole fight like near the end game. So it, it actually got me really interested, and I wanted to play it. So I did do like a little bit of a test run, try to get the audio right. Um, I noticed during Resident Evil, kind of couldn't hear me in a lot of parts. So I did try making some changes hopefully it works um we'll see what happens so anyways let's go ahead and start uh, this is go normal already did the tutorial so Ooh, that's gonna be annoying Put that out of the way so far in just three short years. The sign of a strong leader, sir. No. The will of a strong people. <laughs> and one very able advisor. Thank you, sir. Your team deserves credit as well. Mr. Lightning Bolt. Just doing our job, Mr. Prime Minister. I must admit, I once thought of groups like yours as opportunists, enablers of war. But you've trained our new army well. Order has returned sooner than expected. Perhaps I was wrong about these private military companies. We prefer private security providers, sir. Most of Maverick's contracts do focus on security. Yes, well, the security can mean many things. There's a saying I like. One sword keeps another in the sheath. Sometimes the threat of violence alone is a deterrent. Sometimes by taking a life, others can be preserved. It's the code the samurai lived by. Hmm. A soldier and a philosopher. You are full of surprises, Mr. Lightning Bolt. I could say the same about you, Mr. Prime Minister. <clears throat> what is happening? Someone's blocking the lead vehicle. Hold on. Clear the road! This is official state business! Double cheeked up on a Sunday. I said clear the road. We're authorized to use force if you do. Go 
going to die. Stay calm. Guard the Prime Minister. Like I did, I did, um, like I said, I did try like a little test run. Um, I didn't watch any cutscenes, so I didn't see that, that cutscene that happened already. I just, I just skipped it. Um, I went to this area and just fought a few guys, made sure everything looked on the up and up. It kind of seemed like it had like a little bit of a lag or a delay, slowdown in a way. And I was kind of worried that it was my computer but i kind of th just think i've gotten so used to playing games at like a higher refresh rate that playing a game that's i think i don't know if this game was originally 30 fps or 60 but like it just seems choppy at times and like when you compare it to the cinematic, I mean, you see the cinematic, there's no slowdown, there's no lag or anything, so I don't think it's the, the computer, I think it's just, I think it's just the way the game runs, that it kind of seems like it's slow in some spots, so I kind of just like decided to live with it, and just at times it seemed, like when I was doing the tutorial especially, like, it seemed like everybody was moving like super slow, and there was also like a, like I said, like a lag or a slowdown, but I don't know. I think it was just, just me needing to get used to it at the time. It doesn't seem as near as bad as it did earlier, so I don't know. I don't know what it was. If you can't cut through the barricade, try the fence, huh? So you're Jack. What do you want with the Prime Minister? I want him dead. Nothing personal, of course. 
Africa's just getting a bit too peaceful. What? Business ain't been the same since they shut down SOP. A clean break from the war economy. Huh. Well, some of us lack that economy. How's an honest warmonger supposed to make a living? This is your answer? <laughs> Don't do it! Don't worry now. I won't. Not while he's still useful. <sighs> so long. <laughs> Well, the sorry thing about that is that there's probably people that actually do feel that way, you know, like they don't run, they don't like peace and all that because they make a lot of money off of, like wartime, like all the arms manufacturers and you know, all that. Use your ninja run to deploy those shots. Yes, sir, audience. Oh. Okay, so do I need to go for the legs or do I need to go for the face? Well, this leg's almost out. Might as well finish it off. Just need the camera to cooperate a little bit. Move, move, move. Oh. Honestly, thought that was gonna. Ah. I almost pushed the wrong button. Yes, yes, 
Your show. Very good. But do not rest easy just yet, huh? Thoughts. Yes, nice. No damage. Maybe I could have done it on hard. He's on the other side of that collapsed building. Go! I just Careful didn't want to... Keep that up and the whole building could collapse. Look for another way. Okay. Um, I just didn't want to put hard and then get hard stuck somewhere and then... Yeah, that's not fun for anybody. I think we're fine with normal. It's okay. Alright, well, I guess we'll go ahead and leave it off here. Um, uh, like I said, this is Metal Gear Rising or Vengeance. Uh, never played it before, so this is completely blind. Um, I'm looking forward to it, and hopefully y'all are too. Um, with that being said, please consider liking the video, commenting, let me know if you've played this game before and how you feel about it, as I think it's kind of a standout in the series considering it's a total 180 from what the rigid, the normal formula for Metal Gear games are, so it probably wasn't as well received, but I know a lot of people love it, so um, anyways, thank you for watching, I appreciate it, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Later, everybody.